Okay, this is the closing five spindle variable speed drill press. Uh, they're 15 inch heads and four out of the five of them have number two Morse taper. The other one has a journal number 33. Uh, we are going to run the machine for you now. It's got a 20 by 90 uh, inch table. 25 by 95 if you can count the uh, coolant trowel. You can see the variable speed working there and Angel's running it lower. That's one head. Now we're going to head number two. Uh, yeah. Yep. You can see a bunch of the heads also have Jacob's drill chucks. Okay, there you go, that's number two. Number three. Very good. By the way, the serial numbers, uh, the first head's a model 1639, which is the Morse taper one, I mean the Jarno taper one, and the other ones are all 1687s. He's running that, okay. That's head number four. Head number five. Okay. Okay. Now, that, by the way, this is a, um, a mist coolant thing, and I'm going to walk around the back for you. They're all setups to run off of one power line. 220 volt. 220 volt. You can see that's the power line there on the floor. Again, that's the table. You don't have really many. Oh, oh Angel's raising and lowering the head of that one, of the fourth one. Do another one just to show that. Unlocking it, lowering it. Each head has a mechanism to raise and lower. All right, again, this is the five spindle drill press. Uh, you saw that all the heads do run, all the variable speeds work. Uh, they're all run off of one central uh, electrical cable. Um, and I think that's about it. Thanks for watching the video.